Hello gorgeous, it's Jen. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are talking about taking your look from day to evening with just a little change of the eyeshadow. So I have my face done and I actually just filmed another video using all um, e.l.f. products, but on my eyes I've switched it up and now have my Makeup by Mario palette, which I love. And I am going to jump into this Hip Dot glitter palette that I got recently that I've just been dying to get back into. So I want to show you how to take a neutral, warm look and amp it up with some glitter. So I'm going to match my shirt. I have black and white on, which really I could put anything on with it. But I think what I'm going to do is use this shade right here and it is called dramatic dramatic is right here and it looks like a orange with some green and gold glitter so that is the one we are going to play with my face is done let's hope for not a lot of fallout but we are going to jump right into it and then i'll give you a couple other tips and tricks while we go on so dramatic i'm going to put on my finger and i'm just going to go in A nice glitter shadow will always amp up the drama if you are going out for the evening or just want to look extra special. Wow, that is beautiful. This is the first time I've used this shade. go all the way across fold it up just a little bit in the center so many different colors I don't even think that the cameras are doing this justice or the camera is doing this justice so we have that glitter on. The first thing I would tell you to do is make sure that you wipe away any fallout, which it did. If your face is all set with the powders, I just wouldn't have damp concealer underneath. You should be fine. So that cleaned up. The next thing I'm gonna do is take some black liner. This is my one from Essence. This is the Extreme Lasting Black Liner. And I'm going to make sure that my waterline has some black in it. I'm gonna go along the outer edge. Now remember, the face is already done. I already have mascara on. So we are just amping up the look. I am just taking it up a little bit on the corner and then blending it in. You could go for a bold wing if you wanted to. I'm gonna go a little bit underneath I'm going to I'm going to put a little in that waterline. And now I'm going to go back into that makeup by Mario. I'm gonna deepen up the underneath the eye. I'm gonna go in with my Profusion, actually. Actually, I have a new Sigma brush. My new Sigma, this is the Medium Sweeper E54. It came with my uh, Untamed palette. And I'm going in with, I think this shade right here. You could use the black, but I'm gonna start with that one and see where that takes us.
very nice. Now, if you wanted to deepen up that outer corner, we could go in. I would probably go in with this darker shade right here, not necessarily the black, but the chocolate brown. This is a Sigma E33, and I'm just gonna stamp it in there, and then make small circular motions. Just lightly blend it forward with whatever's left on the brush just for a more smooth even look take a flat brush and take one of the lighter shades here let's go with this one and just put that right underneath the brow bone And of course, I would update your mascara. Let's make sure that that mascara is fresh because you don't want any glitter particles on there. So add another coat of your mascara. Just the elf lash it loud. Just throwing that on. Check the complexion, make sure we don't need any more powder. I think we are good. The brows are on. You could define the brows a little bit more. I have a very natural looking brow today. This brow pencil is from Real Her. You could define them just a little bit more. Make them a little bit darker little bit more structured. This is the best time if you're even if you're not going out for the evening, you're home from work, you don't have anywhere to go and you want to practice some makeup skills. I've had people say, oh, I can't wear glitter or, oh, I can't wear those colors. This is the time to play. Play when you're, you can have an opportunity, if you're not going anywhere, play and see. It's just makeup. It washes off, right? We're having fun. So I've just deepened those brows a little bit. We brush them out. We want to set it. I'm going to throw a little bit of the, um, Elf Wow Brow in there. Just, that does add, this one does have some color in it, so it just adds even more. If you wanted to go with a bolder lip, you could. The general rule of thumb is that if you go bolder on the eyes, you should go lighter on the lips, but you do you. I absolutely have done both. You could go lighter on the lips, so Tell me what you think about the glitter eyes. I think this is great. I would 
curl my hair, do something nice with it to go out, uh, if this were for real. Uh, but right now we're just gonna sport the, the bunny ears here for you. All right, let's go ahead and throw some false lashes on. I love my magnetic lashes from Ardell, so I'm just gonna throw those on now that that mascara has had a chance to dry. top lash and then slide this one underneath and then they just slide right off at the end of the night. No glue, no muss, no fuss. I've worn these for years and I love them. Just have to make sure that they're on straight and then it takes it up takes it up another level. So I hope that this was fun for you. I just honestly, I wanted to have another opportunity to play with these hip dot glitters. They are so much fun. I do recommend them. I have one with the deeper glitters and one with lighter glitters. And I have worn this brown for a nice smoky eye. Oh, so many. They are fantastic. I do prefer the lighter shades than the darker shades because if there is any creasing that happens, it's the lighter shades are more forgiving. But I hope this was fun. If you have not subscribed, subscribe before you leave. Leave a comment below. Let us know the steps that you take to update your makeup before going out. Do you wash your face and start all over? What do you do if you don't have time? What's the most important thing to you? If you're, is it making your eyes a little bolder? Is it throwing on a red lip? Tell us what you like to do to amp it up for a night out when maybe there isn't time to redo it. Leave that comment. Have a fabulous day. Thank you so much.